<laughs> it's uh, Donnie Wahlberg and uh, Jordan Knight in the studio with the Burt Show this morning. All right, Donnie, let's talk about the reason why you are here in Atlanta this weekend. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm throwing a party. Big so time. I'm not even going to, I'm not going to say any Atlanta reference when I say the word party. I'm throwing a party tonight. I don't even know. Where's the party? It's at Life Nightclub on at, Cheshire Bridge Road. That, sorry, Life Nightclub. I'm, I'm in a half a coma. I just got off the airplane and, uh. I'm I'm hurting. Okay, but it's at Life <laughs> Nightclub, and uh, yeah, I, I, I'd like to say you know I'm here you know promoting my song, but the reality is I'm here to hang out with a ton of fans and have a great time. I mean I'm gonna perform and sing and um, I I mean sing my song, which is kind of weird to even say, but uh, but I'm sorry guys. And didn't you <laughs> also say you're gonna do tar tardy for the party? No, I'm going to dance. I told you I wouldn't bring it up, and you just brought it up. <laughs> You're going to dance to Tardy for, for the party tonight? I'm going to... Um, I always dance to Tardy for the party. Do you really? I, I, I love that show. Serious? Yeah. Yeah. Like, it's like Tool Academy <laughs> and Real Housewives of Atlanta, man. That's it. And, uh, yeah. You know, Kim from, cool. uh, Kim from Real Housewives is on with us all the time. She's going to be so stoked when she hears that. Yeah, that show's great. So I like I like Nini though. Sorry, one of them just got the boot, right? Charade, charades. You know she's not going to be on the show anymore. Well, are you bummed you about that? Is that going to send you in a phone today? <laughs> no, no. I, I'm I'm a Nini. I'm a Nini girl. <laughs> you need to tweet, tweet that. <laughs> um. So and Jordan, you are here for a separate reason. Yeah. This weekend. Yep. Oh. Um. Well, I, I'm down here recording some music and. Um, in, in every city that I've been recording, and I'm doing an event called Jordan Idol. So it's it's another way to connect with the fans, and um, it's like a, a, they get up and, and compete, just like American Idol, and the the lucky fan gets to uh, uh, work in the studio with me. Right on. Oh, that's yeah, great. So. Are you going to be one of the judges? Uh, no, no, no. Okay. Um, the guys I'm working with, uh, Brian Michael Cox and his, and his cousin Kendrick, uh, they're coming down. They're Grammy Award winning producers, so... Well, that, those, that's for the serious singers that come down. They'll, they'll judge them. There's no judgment on the fans, really. Um, so it's like no stress. No, no stress. No one's going to rip on you like For the fans, it's, it's more like karaoke. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah. At so this cool. stage in the game, can any fan do anything original to get y'all's attention? Or have you seen it all? Um, I, I think they can. I mean... You know, it just depends. I mean, I think someone can get your attention in any moment doing any particular thing. Your eyes caught my attention when I walked in the room, nice. in fact. Dude, it's <laughs> taken you, it's yeah. taken you 12 I minutes. Say, yeah. I'm surprised. I know, I'm, I'm moving I slow. I you told are. you I'm a little tired from the flight. <laughs> I mean, last time you were in here, it took you 12 I'm seconds. Sorry. I know, I know. I'm off my game. I think Jen was getting a little hurt there. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking about those Dunkin' Donuts downstairs and, and the Waffle House after that. But um, And you no. know now, by the way, just as a side note, she's totally and completely, by every definition, single now. Was the last Bert time and you were Jeff here. like to announce this to everyone. <laughs> she was, I'm just saying. Celebrity softball games. I'm I mean, not you saying. name it. They like to announce this now. I'm just saying. That's all. Mm. I'm not saying. And her inhibitions adjust significantly after two glasses of wine. <laughs> <laughs> now that is true. Does <laughs> 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 nice. anybody have a bottle of Pinot on you right now? Uh, no, but um, I have some... Uh, a distiller and a, uh, some Dunkin' Donuts coffee. I think you can make it into moonshine if you, if you, if you if throw a few donuts in there. It's a really good question, though. I mean, you guys have been doing this for so long. Like, if a, if a fan really wants to get your attention now, like, when's the last time a woman did something so outrageous that you're like, that's somebody I will never forget? Um, I, I don't know. I'm not big on the outrageous stories, but I think they do it every day. I mean, I, I, like, I identified about eight people outside from either having met them before and remembering them or from Twitter or whatever. I mean, it's, you know, uh, the one thing about our fans is they have, a, most of them have a very great sense of humor and they, they're very good at finding ways to get our attention. You know, they, they, whether it's a sign that's, you know, funny or they'll find some obscure thing that like Jordan said in the interview 20 years ago, you know, and they'll put it on a sign and, you know, and, and you're in a, an arena full of 20,000 people and you just look at the sign and it's like one of us will see it. You know, it's mm -hmm. like 
Jordan had a quote before that said he liked ketchup on his eggs, you know, and it, and it became this funny line amongst the group, like Jordan likes ketchup, like it's a real important detail. And then a fan shows up 20 years later with a sign that says, Jordan, I got ketchup for your eggs. It's like, <laughs> right. it's funny. I mean, it's, it's very funny. inside joke. Yeah. yeah. And stuff like that. Yeah. They just, they just get it. Uh, Donnie Wahlberg and Jordan Knight in studio and Kim Zolziak from Real Housewives <laughs> now on the phone. Huh? For real? Uh-huh. Oh, man, I told y'all, hey, girl, you're going to get in trouble. <laughs> <laughs>